everyone welcome back uh we are doing some more stormworks today we are jumping back into our beginner base challenge uh we're here with our boat uh we set some rules and parameters last time we're gonna try and stick with them and hopefully we can get this uh this boat to kind of do some stuff for us rescue some people save some stuff do some deliveries that kind of thing uh so yeah so let's uh let's jump right in uh, last episode, we worked out our hull. We kind of got like a base shape for it. Uh, there are a few things that I do not like about it, like this little front section here, kind of how flat this is. J just some things that are just kind of eyesores at the moment, but I think we'll be okay. I think if we do a little bit of work here today, we can actually clean it up, make it look a little bit nicer. I think the first thing I'm gonna do is actually start by bringing the deck down. I'm gonna pull this out here and we're gonna Bring our deck down. I think, yeah, see? We'll leave a front section up here. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Can't take all of that. And we'll just kind of fill that in. All right, let's do, do a little test here. We saved some cash on that one. We went down in price since our last time. Yeah, see, that's nice. I see, I like that. Nice little edge. Keeps us feel like we're falling off. Still way above waterline, so we're good to go. All right, let's kind of... I think I want to clean this up a little bit more, too. Let's... You know what? Symmetry mode always helps. Speed things up in this game. Let's see. We'll get rid of that. You have the... You know what? Let's see. I don't know why I'm doing this other than the fact that I don't like straight edges. So this is really just an eyesore that I'm trying to take care of. All right, we'll leave that like that, I think. And let's box this in here. All right, can we not get in there, guys? Come on. There we go, okay. Nice little step up. Let's see, we know it. We can even do that in here as well. Let's do that. Kind of get like this little step up here into uh, the front section on the bow of the boat here. Just give it a little bit different look. I hate it. Um. Well, all right, you know what? We're dealing with it for now. It is what it is. Um, let's... That'll look better, sloped a little bit more. Yes, it does. Okay, so let's get, uh, obviously, a seat. We need a seat for this. I've already got one kind of set up here. Um, you know, let's just go straight center mass here with a seat. Is that it? That works, okay. Center mass for the seats. Let's figure out Another one of our rules was that we needed room for 10 passengers. So I think if we come 10 passengers, I think we'll just start uh, maybe trying to figure out where some of these go. Um, I am going to want a helm here for this boat. So let's go ahead and let me knock out some of that real quick so we don't get in the way of it. Uh, let's see. We need some gauges and stuff in there, can't we? Yep. Uh, let's see. Make that nice and small like that. All right, so let's get our seats in here. I think if we use some wedge pieces, that's one seat, that's two seats, that's three seats, that's four, that's five. So this is our 10 right here. We now have the ability to save our 10 people, which is what we wanted. Um, we're gonna need some room back here, which we have plenty of for cargo. 
Uh, we have room for firefighting and all that other kind of equipment we're gonna add. Uh, so let's uh, let's see. We got our ten people. Now let's go ahead and start looking at some of our. You know what? We'll just do it through this way. Let's go to our equipment. Um, let's see. Fluid cannon. Uh, let's see. I'm definitely gonna want a fluid cannon. This is gonna be our firefighting abilities here. Let's get rid of this. Ooh, is this not gonna fit in there? Um, no, it's not. So we're gonna be doing some rebuilding here. Fluid cannon, nice. We ought to put out some fires with that. Some nice big fires with this as well. Finish that off. Oops. Whoops. Whoops. Uh too excited to hit delete. Too excited to hit delete. Okay. Um, we'll get rid of that. Bring that in there. Alright. You know, we can actually, because that's an empty space, you know, I'm gonna put a fire hydrant or a fire extinguisher right in there. Just in case for some reason the hose doesn't work, we have a little backup right there. And that'll be for any onboard fires as well. All right, so we got fire, fire extinguisher. We'll have to build our pump system for that in a minute. Let's see. We're still way under cost. We're doing really good on that. Um, I actually think I'm gonna flatten this off one more. Just so, yeah, see, just for a little bit more stability on the water. I think we'll be okay with that. Oh, whoa, game. All right, so we're gonna just uh, design upside down for a second. All right, there we go. Let's double check this, spawn it in. We're only at 4,000, we're doing good. Not bad, not bad, let's see. Um... Definitely a little nose heavy, which that'll be all right. Since we start putting our engines in and getting those worked out, we should be good. Uh, let's see. Let's get off of this. Oh, we don't need to go to the map. Get off of this. Go back to our workbench here. Um, the I know I need some gauges. Uh, we're going to spell it right today. We're going to spell it right again. Gauges. But really? Are they all sensors? What, what's... What am I missing here? Dials, that's why. Okay, dial. Alright, so we're going to want one for... Let's see, we're going to have... We're going to do one engine in this vehicle. So we'll just do for testing purposes right now. We'll have our engine RPS, our out RPS, our speed. And I think that's all we're going to need for right now. You can always add more later, tweak it later. But for the sake of the challenge. Am I gonna be able to see those? I think those might be too high. Uh let's let's face them forward. Yeah, we'll face them forward. I think it'd be easier to tell what's going on there. Uh we're gonna need a button so we just go with a simple push push button for our starter let's see we got our starter in here and we're gonna need a throttle right these are all the basics to getting us going Okay, so we can start our engine. We can throttle our engine up. Um, I think we can do everything from there. All right, so let's get... I don't know. I think I'm gonna put a little bit of paint on it. I don't know. Maybe not. Uh, let's 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 try to figure out this. Let's get our, our pump going here. Um, we need some room here. Okay, so we got the pump. We'll go down. We can figure out where we're going here. Okay, so this is our hole down. Not a problem. So we're gonna need some pipe. Guess we've got an angled piece. 
And we're gonna go straight piece. And we're gonna bring an angle piece down. And we're gonna bring a straight piece down. I'm also gonna need a pump. And we're gonna go full big pump with this guy. I wanna shoot, shoot water really far here. And we're gonna wanna go with a fluid port to bring in water. All right, I think that's everything that we're gonna need. So let's get our pump back up here. Let's, oops, let's see our, oh, our fluid cannon. Uh, I've lost that, where does that go? Fluid cannon here. All right, so we got our fluid cannon. All right, so we're gonna get a straight piece coming down. I think what we'll do is we'll just put our fluid port here, and this is where it will uh, it'll just pull, it'll just pull water into the, the pump. All right, there we go. Whoops. You know what? For ease of doing this, guys, let's go ahead and just uh, let me just cut some cut some out here, so we can see what we're doing. Okay, so we need to come up into there where's our pump gonna go this is our large fluid pump uh real quick let's put it down and okay so the higher up one is our in and the this is our out okay we need in from down below you know what? we're gonna do it one more over for the sake of Making things easier. All right, that goes there. And then we'll take a angle piece. Go there, straight piece there. Do the same things on this side. We're gonna come in with a straight angle. Angle up, one up. As you can see here, and we need one more there. There we go, all right, perfect. Uh, so as soon as we get some batteries in here, that will be good to go. All right, so that's all hooked up. Let's see. Uh, I wanna get some batteries. Let's get some batteries, because we'll need those. I don't think we'll need a whole lot, so I'm just gonna go grab a couple small ones here. And where's our center gravity right now? Center gravity's still good. Let's go ahead and just plop these. Do symmetry mode, do one, two. I think we'll be good with four batteries on this boat. I don't think we should have any problems, especially with some generators running. Uh, the only thing that's really gonna require our battery power a whole lot is gonna be our starter and our lights and maybe our fluid pump. I think we should be good with those. Um, yeah. So I think we've got our batteries in, we've got our seats in, we've got our firefighting ability in. We don't have our medical stuff in. Uh, I think we'll do that next time when we start cleaning some more of this up, figure out what our deck looks like. But yeah, I think I'm gonna end the video there today. Uh, we've actually gotten a little bit further along here. Uh, next time we're gonna be doing paint and engines, I think. So guys, I appreciate it. If you have enjoyed Stormworks, please make sure you hit that like button. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button as well. It does help this channel out a whole lot and we'll see you on the next one.